it is very easy to make an exact copy of another table with data or with no data. As you can see here, right off the bat, we've created employee table eight, and it's got a wide list of columns. It's been created, it's been loaded, it's got data. Let me show you the syntax to create a copy of this. And I'm gonna say, create table, table name, as employee table eight with data. This is going to make an exact copy of that table, same indexes, same everything, and bring the data over. That's an easy way to make a copy of a table. Now, let me show you a second version of this. I'm going to say the same thing down here, except I'm going to use the term with no data. You have to either say with data or with no data, and in this case, it's going to create the table exactly like the real table, except it will have no data in it. We just saw how easy it is to make an exact copy from another table, but I'm using a different technique here. Once again, our table already exists. It has data in it, but I'm going to use a different syntax. Previously, we saw create table, my new table name, as the old table. It makes an exact copy of that, but this is different here. Notice that I say create table, my new table name, as open paren, select asterisk from employee table eight, close paren, with data. And you know, I don't want it to be an exact copy. I want it to have a new primary index, and I've chosen it to be depth no. I've done the same thing down here, and I've changed the primary index again, but this time I said with no data. Once again, you can see we have our table already created. It's already been loaded with data, and then we want to make a copy of it. But be careful. Look at this. We're going to say create table, employee table 13 is the new table name as open paren select everything from employee table eight close paren with data since we've used the open paren select asterisk from syntax it's not going to make the exact same table structure so in a sense you have not given this a primary index so since you didn't mention the primary index here it's going to pick the first column and make it a non-unique primary index. Be careful. Now we're going to make a copy of our real table and we're going to make an error here. Notice here we're going to say create table employee table 14 as employee table 8 with data and I want to give it a new primary index. They say you can't do that. The minute I say create table table name as the other table name, it says, I'm copying the exact structure. You can't make changes to that. You got one choice, with data or with no data. So this turned out to be an error. This lesson brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Need to learn SQL for Nintiza, Teradata, or Aster? Visit coughingdw.com for our helpful training guides. With Teratom, SQL stands for So Quickly Learned. Hi, this is Tom Coffing. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please hit subscribe to make sure you are kept up to date on all our videos.